chicken in a cup yeah. that we started with. Let me show you. All you need for this is a regular plastic cup okay. and uh, some yarn, or you can use cotton string. We'll work for this, but nothing nylon uh, because the, the cotton aspect or the wool aspect makes it kind of sticky, it gives it a little friction. All right, and, uh, and a paper clip. So what we do is we get a, uh, a piece of string here, and we're going to tie it. I know I have one here. Uh, or cut it about, uh, I'd say about a foot and a half. And you poke a hole in the cup. Uh, use a nail, have a grown-up help you uh, poke a hole with a nail. The string goes in. You tie a paper clip around the end, and it looks like this. Okay. So we got the string inside, paper clip on the top. You're almost ready to go. That's for you. Okay. Next, a little piece of paper towel. We get this wet. There we go. All right, hold on to that. And then let me get one ready for me here. It's the call of the chickens. And this has to do with sounding boards. Uh, there's a reason that there's a lot of wood in a piano, because the sound has to vibrate throughout the wood. So if we were just doing this without the sounding board, where did my string go? We'll use this. If we were just doing this without the sounding board, yeah. it would sound like this. You don't hear anything. Nothing. So the cup is going to act as a sounding board. So take your uh, paper cloth and wrap it around, all right, like a little string taco okay. there. All right, then squeeze tight, and then pull down in short little jerks. There you go. The screaming chicken. Look at that. That is crazy. I uh, love it. Your parents are really going to be confused when they hear this coming from it. So you can keep that. And then when you're all done and you're ready to put it away, you just go like this. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. There you go. See, it puts itself away. Just like the vacuum right. cleaner. Yeah, exactly. All right, we'll have all the instructions on the website so kids can do that. All right.